Philip E. Tetlock, Expert Political Judgment, How Good Is It? How Can We Know? New Edition The book Expert Political Judgment, How Good Is It? How Can We Know? New edition of by Philip E. Tetlock delves into the complex world of expert opinions in politics, society, and business. The summary unravels the standards that can be used to judge the validity and reliability of these expert opinions, particularly in cases where answers are not black or white. It discusses the impact of beliefs on the assessment of expert judgment, the correspondence theory to evaluate expertise, and the fascinating distinction between hedgehogs and a foxes, as two different thinking styles that affect judgment and forecasting abilities. The book also touches upon scenario writing, how to assess expert predictions, and the misdirection in forecasting due to various factors. Assessing Expert Opinion People rely heavily on expert opinions in various fields, including politics, society, and business. It can be challenging to determine which experts have good judgment, especially in political arguments, as experts have their way of explaining history. However, you can evaluate expert opinions using the correspondence theory, which examines whether their ideas are consistent with the real world. To assess an expert's ability to make accurate forecasts about objective events, you can consider whether they choose easy-to-predict events, their accuracy rate, and whether their verbal predictions can be quantified. Additionally, an expert's ability to adapt their belief systems to new conditions is crucial. Nonetheless, luck can also play a role in separating success and failure. The Skepticism Surrounding Experts and Predictions the world is too complex to make accurate predictions, according to ontological skeptics, while psychological skeptics believe that our minds are not capable of making predictions. People have an innate need to control their environment and often struggle with randomness and unpredictability. Experts are necessary in modern society, but their accuracy is limited, and they tend to become overconfident. However, People are more forgiving of officials who consult with acknowledged experts, even if their policies fail. The Thinking Styles of Hedgehogs and Foxes The book explores philosopher Isaiah Berlin's categorization of people as hedgehogs and foxes based on their thinking and problem-solving approaches. Hedgehogs have a centralized worldview and a closed belief system, while foxes process information without a guiding moral or artistic landmark. Although most people fall on a continuum between these two categories, each thinking style has distinct differences in judgment. Foxes have better judgment due to their balanced thinking style, while hedgehogs seek new evidence to support their original thoughts, which can make them more pessimistic or optimistic. Foxes' forecasts are more accurate than hedgehogs, but the media still prefers to quote hedgehogs since their conclusions sound more dramatic. Moreover, the public's general worldview influences how experts see the world, making it difficult for them to accept new facts that challenge their beliefs. Experts can also convince themselves that they can predict events and outcomes that they clearly cannot predict, showing the same reasoning style as the general population. Hedgehogs are often less accurate at forecasting complex social perceptions and are prone to hindsight bias. The Art and Science of Scenario Creation Scenario writers are skilled at creating various versions of the future to plan for contingencies. Royal Dutch Shell's analysts used scenarios to predict future oil prices and accurately predicted events such as the 1973 Middle East War and Russia opening up its oil reserves in the 1980s. However, creating numerous forecasts means that consultants are bound to be right occasionally, and their predictions are not always accurate. Psychologist Amos Tversky's support theory explains that people downplay a set of outcomes probability while overestimating the likelihood of individual events within the set. Scenario consultants can be helpful when the predominant popular choice is to continue what people are doing, when there's an abrupt shift in the status quo, or when consultants believe the status quo is set to change. However, Consultants can also mislead people by focusing on the minutiae of one specific event, leading them to ignore known reference points. Society would be better off if experts were held accountable to standards of evidence that command broad assent. 
The Fallacy of Frequent Forecasters Frequent forecasters are no better at predicting breaking events than non-experts. Despite their lack of verifiable track records and accuracy, the media continues to rely on them for expert opinions. Inaccuracy in forecasting persists because people are not sophisticated enough to separate conflicting forecasters and tend to agree with arguments that reinforce their existing views. Some intentionally construct arguments that can't be evaluated, like politicians who make ambiguous predictions to avoid being wrong. To correct this fallacy, predictions should be quantified against actual outcomes in the light of peer review or established benchmarks. The quality of a prediction should be logically analyzed and not based on the forecaster's affiliation, academic credentials, or appearance. The notion that history might turn out to be, as radical skeptics have stated, one damn thing after another, is something to reflect upon. After diving into the realm of expert opinions, the book summary highlights the sobering fact that despite their credentials, experts don't consistently make accurate predictions and often display overconfidence as their expertise rises. It demonstrates that good judgment among experts comes from their ability to think critically about their thought processes and beliefs. Furthermore, it emphasizes the importance of holding experts accountable to standards of evidence. Although forecasting isn't foolproof, the book suggests that readers should be more discerning while evaluating expert opinions and predictions, understanding that luck and the unpredictability of events play significant roles in the outcomes.